jerky, beef 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 jerky. rock star guitar god thing that they do they just let the they let it ring out <coughs> so guys <laughs> we're live hey everybody welcome to extreme food reviews my name is daniel and i'm jonas and he's drinking <clears throat> oh man it has been a really we live we're live it has been a crazy jerky week we have uh we had uh eden from um Rhea's Roadkill Beef Jerky sent us out a package of, two packages actually, of Canadian Steak Beef Jerky, which is uh, which is their newest flavor in honor of National Beef Jerky Day, which is Tuesday the 12th. Can I move that out of the way? Kick that out of the way. You don't need that. Um, so we, so we, when he offered, we, I'm tripling off my words today. We had originally talked to um, Eden and he had said, I've got a new flavor out. You guys want to try it? I mean, I said, absolutely. But do me a favor, send me out an extra package because I'd like to share it with our subscribers. So he did. He sent us two. One was a, a smaller one, like a three ounce one that we tried. It was and pretty good. It was, it was really good. Um, but he sent us the bigger six ounce one that we're going to share with everybody. But also in our crazy beef jerky week <laughs> thing that we do, we had made we made a uh, our own uh, beef jerky that we're calling the murky jerky. Murky jerky, and this one is uh, one we did in air fryer, which was a pretty interesting thing. We had never really done uh, beef jerky in an air fryer before, so we said, uh, you know, it has heat, it has air. It probably will work, so let's just do it. So we did it, and this is our this is our uh, this is our this is our final product. Our, it's our baby. <laughs> so we have two here: um, Murky Jerky and Ria's Roadkill Canadian Steak Beef Jerky. Yes, we do. No, I just want to say one thing. Yes. There's new Simpsons Tic Tacs. Could you please grab them? Oh, completely unrelated. Completely unrelated. <laughs> we there were... is new Simpsons Tic Tacs. <laughs> we, we... This is real, like, amazing. <laughs> Hold on. Wait. So we have the Bart, which is bubblegum. Uh, Marge, which is blueberry. Blueberry is much, and Homer is. We ran into these. Yeah, Homer is a donut flavor. I don't know if you're a Tic Tac fan. This has nothing to do with beef jerky, but we found these last night, and they are so good. I have decided that the Homer. Um, Here's two of Bart. We're the, gonna go through them. The Homer donut flavor is my absolute favorite. This was I donut flavored Tic Tacs. So this is Bart. Bart. You, you had me at donut. Then you go. What do you got? I got. Are we actually gonna taste test them now? Yes. To heck with jerky. We're eating Tic Tacs. Which one is which? I can't tell. They look identical right now. Different faces on me. Oh, oh, they're I'm old. putting them in order. Oh, I didn't even notice these. So, and I'm going to put them in order so you can L see. Like, I can tell that there's a different face on well, a Tic Tac. let the people see. I, I need these. What is it? What do we got? Oh, there is. So, so this is, wow, I don't even think you can focus. It's a tiny little Marge on the face of this Tic Tac, and a tiny little Bart. And, uh. For Homer? Where's Homer? Right here. Homer smells good. Yeah, he does. Here, I'll give you two. All right, so before we get to jerky, apparently we're going to spend a little minute with a Tic Tac. Get two more. Let's get two more. This, this, you know what? They might come to the point where YouTube offers like a smell of vision and they could smell our breath, so this would be a good thing. Get it's like Extreme Food Reviews if it were a scratch and sniff channel. Which one are we doing first? I'm going with Homer. All That's right. my absolute famous. Uh, clunk get it. two. Oh, I'm sorry. I should have tried mixing a couple. Yeah, you are definitely the best. Homer is like the best. Strawberry frosted at Duncan's. Imagine like the best donut cake ish flavor into a Tic Tac, and that's what Tic Tac has done. So, of the three, we we actually tasted all of them. Homer's the best because he's opinion. in our opinion. Uh, second best was probably the bubblegum Bart, and last was the blueberry 
Marge. She's all right. I'll come back Hello, to those. Hello, Pam. How are you doing? Hey, Pam Duffy. How you doing? Thanks for stopping by. We I was in uh, Pam's live stream earlier giving her trouble. That's kind of what I do. Kind of like if you have a live stream and I'm your friend, you go like, oh. I'm, Pam's probably sitting there going, I'm going to try to talk about felting today, and I hope Daniel doesn't show up because he's just going to say something, and, and then I'm going to have to respond to it or ignore it. And ignoring it is worse because then I'll just say more things. All right, so we're doing Bart next or? Um, oh, yeah, we're eating Tic Tacs. Pam, we're eating Tic Tacs. They got new flavors of Tic Tacs, so we're. They're Simpsons, and they're real good. We're, we're tasting them. <laughs> um, I like, uh, let's go with, uh, I know, I already tasted these. Bart's the next, the best one. No, I mean second best one. Homer's the best. Uh, 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 I'd be worried if you were not trouble. Yeah, that's true. I, I like Bart. I do. I just don't want to eat. I don't want to eat Marge. I, I hope I don't get demonetized for saying that. But she, her, she's kind of blueberry-ish. I get it because it goes with her hair. But she's not doing anything for me. So back. Come on, tough guy. What? Do I have to? I don't. I'm doing it. You are weird. Yeah, it's just weird. The the, the Marge Simpson blue um, blueberry Tic Tacs. I took your Bart. They're just kind of sour. I'm, it doesn't do anything for me. Hi, Check It Media. Check It Media. Hey, I have to take a quick second to say thank you to Check It Media, who was really instrumental in giving me some feedback last week on our very first live stream. I appreciate your help. It's really hard to do these things. If you could see the behind the scenes, we have microphones coming from one angle. We've got, you know, studio lighting and tripods and to try to make it all happen is tricky. And I appreciate you giving us some insight on how we look and how, do, how we sound. How do we sound today? How do we look today? Do we look and sound all right? I know there's a delay. So tell us if we're, if we're okay, if you can hear us. Can you hear us okay? Check it's got to get up early, 5 a.m. Well, a lot of our friends are in different parts of the world, so the time zones that we're hitting them at are like, half of them are like, it's like Pam is, Pam, I believe, is five hours ahead of us, so it's it's after nine o'clock her time. Uh, set up and sound all good. Thank you, Pam. I appreciate that. That's so, good. So the thing that we were really focusing on today was the two beef jerkies that we have, and, and I gotta be honest, when I say two, it's it's one and a half. <laughs> because we have professional beef jerky by our friends at uh, Ria's Roadkill who have their new Canadian steak flavor. And then the one, our own murky jerky that we whipped up in the kitchen. Which I personally think is actually pretty good. We're not so bad in the kitchen. Oh, he's... Check it, medians and... He's in Holland, it's over 10 p.m. And hello... It's seven Rosani. over... Designs Masquerade. Rosani. I talked to her the other day. We were talking about pickles. <laughs> we were talking about making spicy pickles. Am I saying that name right, Rosani? Just give me a yes or a no. It'll come up 20 minutes from now in the chat. Um, yeah, we the spicy pickle recipe we did that uses habaneros and chili, she was asking, you know, like, is this nuclear? Am I going to have to, like, check my health insurance to make sure I can... I can be treated after I make this recipe, and it, it is a it is a spicy recipe. So we tried to talk it down and tame it down a little bit, removing some peppers. I hope I hope my answer gave you a, a little it bit of a advice. Heart exclamation point! Yes. All right, Rosani. So it's Rosani. Wow, that is really good. I don't even have that. Where did you find that? She's got all the uh, she's got all the right emojis. That's pretty sick. Rosani is uh, Italian for my emojis are better than yours. So. But while we're here, and I might repeat myself today, in the description, I posted links to the two videos where we made this jerky, which is our murky jerky, and also links to the uh, Ria's Roadkill Canadian Steak uh, beef jerky. And the way we're going to do this today is all we're going to do, if you were here um, last week for our very first live stream... Oh. Is we just pull up the we just pull up the comments from one of those videos, and TubeBuddy has a pick a winner feature that you click a button and it just picks someone from the comments. So while we're kind of going through this live stream, just click on one of those links, head over and drop a comment in either the Rias the Rias or the what are you pulling up? It didn't pop up. Oh wow! 
Look at Jonas oh, is on. way more technical than I am. Hold on, wait, it's gonna pop up in like two <laughs> seconds. Ready? Boom. <laughs> there we go. So that link above our heads is the link to uh, Rhea's Roadkill Jerky. That's their. Oh boy, I need Pam's help. I'm gonna just say that's their Etsy store, but she's taught me that that's their Etsy store. Because it's not pronounced the way I thought it was. Um, we have check it saying share the link on link it in so over 100 plus persons see it. Thank you, my man. I appreciate it. Thank you. Um, so yeah, so listen, we're gonna we're gonna be we don't hang here long. Our 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 quick stream. Our history of streams. Meaning this one and the other one, <laughs> we're pretty short, so we won't be here long. But I want to give you an if you haven't commented on the two uh, videos where we talked about Rias and we made the murky jerky, head over, just click on the links in the description, leave a comment in one of those, and we're gonna pull up a winner from the comments. If you're interested, if you're not interested, <laughs> Pam, no, I say it wrong. It's Etsy. It's a a it's a it's a. She's got, I can't it's do a Scottish, it. I can't do a Scottish accent. It's, it's She's it. like, you're doing it wrong. Right, that's bad. You're I sound like, I, I, all I have it's is like, sexy. I have Scotty from the Enterprise Star Trek. It's the uh, only reference point I have in listening to you. So, I can be good, that is true. So listen. Oh, Gamer Gramps, hello. Hey, there's Tyler. Tyler, good to see you, my man. Our summer is doing very good. Um, yeah, I, the summer has barely hit. So Tyler's off in Canada. Has your summer even hit there yet, Tyler? We have summer in like four school days, four and a half. I yeah, think. how many school days do you have left? Four and a half. Four and a half. And I just got an A on this huge project. We actually, so we did this thing in health, and we had to pick a place, and we had to bring in food for it and make a little thing about it. So it was like, we made this little Japanese restaurant thing out of boxes and stuff. Mm -hmm. And then we brought it in. We had this whole project, and we actually got picked first place. Oh, you didn't tell projects. me you I didn't tell me you got picked first place. Yeah, we're first place. We get a prize for it. They just haven't said what. There you go, live folks. I was there. I was being the doting father, helping him with his what was an international um, food culinary culture project. It was, cool. it was fun. Thank it was you, a lot of fun. Thank you, Pam, and thank you, Gamer Grips. Yeah, so we, uh, but if there was, we found these, we should have brought some of those today. We found these candies that um, they have a wrapper that you can eat. It's like a, some kind of a non nutritive food polymer that they wrap it in that dissolves in your mouth. And Jonas and I tried them, but what we didn't realize is they wrap that in another wrapper that isn't edible. So, so when we tried them, we just threw them in our mouths. And we were kind of disgusted. Like, this yeah. this is horrible. It's not dissolving right. And Thank you, Rosani. Afterwards, we found out, yeah, you got to take the first, the real wrapper off. To then get to the rice wrapper. And then we got to the rice wrapper. And they were really good, though. Yeah, the gummy inside is a lot like a thicker Welch's. Yeah, thicker thicker Welch's. A, a thicker Welch. Speaking of thicker Welch's. Thicker Welch's. How are you doing, Pam? Are you Welch? Who's Welch? Is Welch, what is that, British, Scottish, Welch? Is anyone Welch? I feel like we should There's have some. There's a girl in our school that's Welch. Really? I don't know any other Welch. I, you know, I get so confused by the whole idea of uh, Scotland as a part of the UK, but not really a part of the UK because they sometimes fight. And that's kind of like the way when I talk to people about New England, where I say, I'm from New England. They go, that's great. And then I hear later that I'm from New Hampshire. And they say, I thought you were from New England. And I have to explain that New Hampshire is part of New England, which is part of the United States. It's... It's, it's, we're Americans. We don't do anything easy. But apparently neither do the Scottish. Because they're Scottish. The and, and they're English. But they're not. The <laughs> so listen, I'm going to remind you again. Hit the links below. If you're interested in either the Ria's Canadian Beef Jerky, which I'm going to be honest, this is the winner here. Or the, our own brand of Murky Jerky, which is also really good. Leave a comment over there so when we pick a winner in a few minutes, your comment will be in one of those videos. You guys, comment something you want me to say in a British accent. Comment what? Where? And I'm just saying. Oh, Comment right. something you want me to say in a British accent and I'll say it. Uh, I'm reading. My daughter had an exam and has school off for like three or four months and goes big girl college. Big girl college. Oh my, you know what? I don't know how I don't know how that goes in your country, but in my country, big boy college means empty your wallet because America is not really good at funding education. Um, 
And you said, uh, I have to scroll back up. I forgot where um, Check It Media said he was from. Switzerland? No. Um, no. Holland. 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 So I'm hoping in Holland, the public school system is a little better funded than it is here. We have fantastic schools, just not a fantastic ability to get to them after you leave a certain grade. College and university is just, it's, it's like buying a new home. You want to send your kid to college? Listen. I need you to be very smart, get good grades, and get a scholarship. Does it have a wallet anymore? <laughs> or I'll be selling you to sell all that of this. Too? You have to sell that wallet too? <laughs> I'll be selling. I'll be have to sell a lot more beef jerky to get you into college. Dang. Oh. All right, so where are we at right now? I don't have a wallet anymore. Yeah, it's well, expensive. that's what that's happens, manage, man. I it believe is in so, you, check it. I believe in you. It is so expensive. I, I did two years of college at the University of New Hampshire, and I, even in the way it works in the United States is if you live in state, it's more affordable. They make it more affordable for in-state residents. Basically, you pay taxes. So they part of paying your taxes to the state is you get more affordable education. But even back then, and I'm talking the mid 80s is when I went to college, they were like Tyrannosaurus roaming the earth. And I'm not even sure that the entire layer of the earth had hardened at that point. Um, it was still thousands and thousands of dollars a year to go to school and now it's it's like well yeah you want to get into a state college 40 grand for a year you want to go four says, years check it says you can call me mitchell you it's like michelle but a bit harder without the second oh. l oh oh Mich michael michelle michelle, I don't, michelle. michelle. My michelle. Um, not michelle it's Michel? It's like Michelle, Mich but a bit Michel? harder without the Michel? second L. Michel. 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 I'm just going to add like some odd accent onto it's, it. It's like Michel. It's Michel. <laughs> All right. So listen, the way I'm going to start this is um, we're going to pull up. Let's, uh, let's pull up the first site, Jonas. By the first, um, we're going to pull up the first site. We're going to pull up the first video, which is our murky jerky. Um, let me click over here to make sure I got this set up. Um, oh, he said you, he wants me to say something in British. Oh, did I miss? You did I miss a, it? It was it was in a different chat thing. Oh, he put it's a comment. Tyler posted a comment. That was probably his comment to one of these. So if he wants you to say something, I will find out. Do me a favor, Jonas. Can you no. can you click over to the um, computer screen? All right, now hopefully here, if we do this right, again, we're at novices, um, we should be seeing. Can you guys see our computer screen okay? You guys are gonna have to let me know if it's visible. I'll have to see what he said in a minute. Oh, I'm looking at black. Why is it black? Well, let me give it one more shot. Let me go here, yeah. then go here. Is it cause I have- Oh, hang on, hang on, go back again. Ah, there. Okay. You know what? This is you're you're watching us learn on the fly here. <laughs> so computer screen. Let's go over to um, these are the uh, these. This is inside of our um, back end of our. You're looking at my back end of the channel, and I explained this last week for for any of the creators out there, not to bore anyone else. A really cool thing you can do is if you're having any kind of promotion, if you're running the TubeBuddy app, even the free version. Uh, if you enable it as a browser extension, and I'm going to clip back to me so you don't have to stare at the screen while I'm talking. Um, if you enable the extension, what you'll see is when you open up your video manager, next to it will be a TubeBuddy dropdown. Let's go back over to that. Um, I think you can see it now. Am I doing that right? Perfect. Um, and right in here, you see me scrolling, you see that TubeBuddy dropdown? This is a great way to do giveaways. We do um, we do a lot of them. We've done them before we started live streaming. If you click on that, you'll see over down here has pick a winner, if you can see it. Um, uh, we'll click on that. And this is for our jerky, right? Yeah, this is, so we're gonna do this right, one right now is the Air Fryer Beef Jerky Murky Jerky. We say pick a winner, it opens up a screen and it asks you, would you like to pick a winner random from the comments? And the winner is... So we're gonna pick one. British cook. <laughs> <laughs> and our friend oh Drew the British, British cook, cook, who's not here British right now. British cook. So Drew, 
I, 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 nothing like sending one of your own recipes out to um, yeah. a guy who can actually cook. <laughs> but, Drew, we're going to figure out a way to get this out to you. We know you're in England, and I know there's a little bit of, there's some weird restrictions about how we send things and how we do that. It, it is a total fix, Pam. <laughs> I don't know what that guy said when he commented. Oh, that was Tyler. He probably just dropped a comment in uh, one of the videos. Tyler, post a, if you're still here, post a comment in the chat. Yeah, I want to see what you said. I want to say. Yeah, I want to know what British. you said. Yeah, I think he was asking Jonas so to, was say to say something, in, something in a Canadian accent. Well, Tyler's it was Canadian or British. It was one of them. Yeah, Tyler is from Canada. I, I, uh, I would. In I'm gonna Canadian lie if I tell you which accent. part. He's got all. Yeah, everything with him is like, how you doing, eh? How you doing? Yeah, Daniel asked me to dance on a roof, eh? I'm gonna go dance <laughs> on a roof. Pretty surprising. Oh, that's so good. So listen, congratulations to our dear friend Drew for winning this lovely package. Hey, dear friend. Murky jerky. He's you know, right now, Drew. I've Drew started a new job, so we haven't even seen him online for like the last. I mean, it's been it's been almost a week. He randomly pops up. Pam, have you seen him at all? It's like he'll comment randomly and then disappear because he's just got this new thing. It's a new security job that I joke with him all the time. I, I say he's protecting the queen and the new, the new Royal wedding couple. He's not, he's doing a security job that um, I know is taking up a ton of his time. So Drew, if you do get around to seeing this, we'll be in touch. We love you. We miss you. I make, it's been quiet I make a good, him. it's been really, it's been very quiet. I haven't even seen him post up a new video. That means, um, that means he's really busy because usually he live streams on the weekend, and I didn't, I didn't see anything from him. Well, Drew, if you can get this, hey, wait, to you. I see a spider. Okay, ready? Grab. There's an odd little spider hanging from our thing. Look at that. Put Listen, comment now and win this spider. <laughs> I'm gonna, I don't have the heart to kill him. Hold on, let me relocate him. All right, he's safe. He's safe. Much better. Can you see him on the stream? I don't know. Well, we're looking at we're we've got the three second or five second delay, so I'm looking to see if he showed up there. He didn't. Yeah, well, he was very small and white, but he's still alive. All right, so listen, we're gonna jump right to this. We're not gonna waste your time today. We we're have gonna, another one we got to do. We're get, we've got another. We've got things to do. We got places to be. Yeah. We've got a six ounce package, and uh, six ounces doesn't sound like a lot, but it, this thing is huge. When I tell you, there is a ton of beef jerky in this thing. Um, six ounces is a massive amount of beef jerky. So um, Eden sent this out to us and said, go ahead, give it away. And I'm, I'm just going to go ahead and give it away. I want to make uh, make it clear that he's he is running a special on his site. Look at Mick. Look what he wrote. What? <laughs> Mick Bramante should have eaten the spider. Thank you, Mick. No. No, I mean, uh, thank you. It would be that it would be the brown recluse spider, that one that like, you know, that deadly poisonous. And as a joke, I'd put it in my mouth and and suddenly the stream would end and and I'd be, you know, hauled off to the hospital because I was an idiot. But I'll consider it. It's not it wouldn't be the first time I've eaten a spider. Um so listen, um uh Ria's Roadkill Jerky, we've got the website right here. It's down in the links. Go check them out. They've got a bunch of flavors. We've tried two. We've tried the Canadian steak. Dad. Yes. Can we tell them the animal cruelty story? Oh, uh, we will. We tried the Canadian steak and we tried the habanero, and both were fantastic. And I th and I think Eden has a sale going on on this one for the month of June because of National Jerky Day, which is this coming Tuesday. And, and we can honestly say that no beef were abused in the process of making this jerky. Tell them the story about the about the right. spider I ate. It was octopus. I mean, oh, the octopus I ate. So he made a video about eating an octopus ASMR. And that was when I wasn't around. Hmm. But he ate the octopus. I did. And when we, we posted it, can you try to do like some, uh, what do you call it, the thing to... I did. I tried to do an AdSense, ad... AdSense. Ad, 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 it was AdWords. I tried to ad do a words. little, put a little money behind it. And... Know, advertise our channel. AdWords said it's animal cruelty. I get hit with an animal cruelty restriction because apparently and, cooking an octopus, putting it on a plate and eating it is animal cruelty. What we, we did, we did um, contest that one and, and Google did give it to us and say... 
it's all right. We're uh, we were wrong. You can you can do what you want. So we uh, we're gonna beat more octopus in the future. A lot of it, all the time, anywhere we want. I'm not. Even, I may not even cook it next time. That's that's stupid. That might be cruelty. That might that might be. I may have crossed the line right there. So listen, I'm gonna jump over. And let's take a look at the... Pick another winner, Drew. Oh, computer screen. Um, we're clicking over to our other screen. And the other uh, the other video we put up recently was the Canadian steak, Rhea's Roadkill Jerky, new flavor. We're going to jump into the comments of this one and see if we can find a winner. I'll do the, uh, the drum roll. Yeah, give me the drum roll. Pick a winner. Magdalena Co. <laughs> now this is a tough one because I know that she's out in that area too. I don't think she's ever even had jerky before. She and I had some conversations about um, the differences between um, being in the United States and being out in Europe. Magdalena, if you want it, we'll get it to you. We're sending something out to Drew. We'll figure it out. So if you're interested, we've got... Rhea's Roadkill Jerky here for you. It is, it's really good. Uh, we love Magdalena so much. She's, she's wonderful. She's in, she shows up in everybody's streams. She's, she, she comes to our channel. She comes to uh, Pam's channel. She's in Drew's channel. She's one of those perfect people out there that makes time to always support the YouTube community and all of the creators. We just went from four, view four viewers to seven, so. We're hot. Hey, there's Louis Danielle TV. How you doing, Crypto brother? Crypto cruising, yo, yo, yo. So, yeah, Crypto cruising. Good to see you guys. Hey, listen, so listen, we already picked our winners here. We're moving fast today. The Murky Jerky goes out to our good friend Drew, the British cook. And Magdalena Co. is getting our Canadian steak from Rhea's Roadkill Jerky. This is a great flavor. We've got, the, uh, we've got their site floating above us and all the links down in the description. I do want to say that Jonas and I have been working on something, and I say working in the present tense, but it's actually worked through. We, some of you guys might have known that um, a few weeks ago we put hot sauce on ice cream. Remember what kind we put on? Habanero. Oh yeah, habanero. It was two Trader Joe's flavors. One was habanero and one was chili pepper. And we didn't, the chili, not that they were bad sauces, they just didn't go with ice cream. The habanero was better than the chili pepper, though, didn't you think? So we decided that we would try to come up with something ourselves. And we have a new hot sauce that we created, bottled, tested, that is ready to be sent out, that's going to come out in the next week, um, that we're going to send a bottle. Whenever we make something, we always make two, and we send one out to one of our subscribers because we, we love sharing. So this next thing is going to go out. And when I tell you that the flavor of this one is gonna blow your mind it is crazy it has so many things going on in this one it is unlike any other hot sauce you've ever seen it totally different and we both had it on ice cream and what did you think it was pretty good it was pretty i got my son my son gives it a half a thumbs up he said it was pretty good and if he likes it that means it's really good so keep an eye out for that one. That's going to be up in the next week. We're also, we have, uh, remember, Tuesday the 12th is National Beef Jerky Day. So we put up a uh, video on how to make beef jerky in an air fryer. That one's down in the um, description below. You can link to that one. Uh, check it out. See how to make it in an air fryer. We've also made it in an, uh, in an oven. We're going to be posting that one up this week. So I expect all of you to be paying attention and making beef jerky at home why you're not eating beef jerky i know a lot of my friends are from europe they're from the uk and you guys are like we don't even know what beef jerky is it's like we have sheep we have sheep yeah. sheep jerky we have crypto talking a lot we have it? how's things going <laughs> um, things are going great we have please 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 i want to see tears and pain you want to see tears and pain all right hang on listen i'll get jonas take the mic for a second all right we will have something. Oh God! I'll get you take the mic. A little hot. It's gonna be a little hot. Now, if you want me to say anything in this <laughs> accent, please tell me. I can say anything you want. Right. Ooh, we haven't even had this one yet. I know. If you're gonna have, you know, if you're gonna say tears and pain, we'll get pain 100%. 
If, on it. If, give me the little one. It listen, me. if you want pain, then we're going to go 100% pain. So this is... In this line of work, you have to have uh, you have to have a lot of product around for just this sort of occasion. How so am I listen, allowed to say this? <laughs> what? <laughs> say bloody, bloody hell! Bloody hell! Blo bloody, uh, I can't it's, even do it. It's bloody, bloody hell. hell! So listen, if you want pain, we've got pain. We've got pain 100 percent right there. This is a sauce that's made from one of our other uh, the manufacturer of one of our other favorite sauces, um, which is pain is good. And they have uh, we have the uh, Jamaican jerk blend is it's phenomenal. It's hot. It's really hot. But we haven't cracked this bottle, and it's pain, one hundred percent. So so didn't listen. Seem to cover quite, didn't seem to cover quite a few dialects. I've I got do. Mary Poppins. Plus <laughs> no to, we just we want we wander. It's like it's like listening to someone trying to do uh, an American accent when it's you've got New England, you've got a, a Southern accent, you've got the. Most people usually go for either a southern accent when they're trying to do a New England, I mean, an American accent. They usually go right for the cowboy Texas, like, well, how y'all doing? Because <laughs> that's the easy go. one. Crypto. Crypto always talks, mate. <laughs> right. He always does. Oh, so he's, from, he's, from Liver he's from Liverpool. He's from Liverpool. So anyone says they're, li they're Liverpool, we do like our really, uh, that's the only Liverpool accent we know is we do really bad imitations of Ringo, because that's what you do, right? Like, all right, guys. Yeah, great. It's so nice to see you. Thanks for stopping by. Really appreciate it. <laughs> that, that's the only. That's our bad Liverpool Liverpoolian accent. All right, crypto, my friend. This is for you. Hundred pain, one hundred percent. Yeah, man. All right. I don't so, even have any milk right now, so I might have to steal yours. All right. Well, here's this. Thank you. He wants to see. Whoa, what my gosh! That? Look at that. Is jammed up which on the accent the one dad just did it, it, that's all of them every <laughs> that's, accent that's you will everyone. ever see in your life <laughs> I, listen i gotta this do the wow. bottle dad oh i gotta knock this down there is some congealing hold on there is some stuff going on up top it is like let me get some shake let me get my jiggy on it, it was like Not it was like, sauce, some, was like a paste it was like a paste at the top that wasn't sauce um Oh my gosh, it still looks just as bad. <laughs> All right. Pain 100%. Can we get into a spoon? Well, maybe not. Oh, I, wow. Back end? Is that how we're doing this? Yeah. Get on the back. We'll get it. No, we may have to. No, this is the way to do it. Can you get some? That's Once a you whole get, lot. Ooh, you got, yeah, you got there. All right. I'm gonna go. Oh, I'm gonna go deep though. This much? This is really for you, crypto. All right. All right. Let's clunk it and dunk it. Ah! Ah! That's oh, hot. wow! Yeah, that's right there. <laughs> oh my god. Woo! Yeah, that might be... Wow! That might be 110% pain. Oh, my... Oh, my God. Whose idea was that? That was... Crypto. Woo! Oh, here come the hiccups. Wow. Wow. Oh. That's hot. <laughs> You'll have to excuse me while I recover from this hot sauce. Holy good monkey. Sorry, right, Crypto. Oh. Don't feel guilty. I do this every video. Ooh. Whoa. Does it say don't eat it by the spoonful? Good Lord. This is This is hot. Apparently, there was truth in advertising. Is that is a hundred? Did you leave me anything? Yeah, I love your sip. Wow, that's a hot one. I may have taken too much. I'm just gonna let you guys know very quietly. This is hot. It's it's very it's. I'm gonna go fill your glass with milk. I'll it's back. it's one hundred percent. Anyone who knows me, when I have something really hot, I break right into sweats, and I am right there. I'm crying on this one. 
Wow. Did, can you feel the heat coming through the microphone right now? Oh. I'm doing all right, but I oh. need to get out of <laughs> This should be. This is okay. the... Uh, thank you. Eat some bread. My gosh. Get me a bakery. I want a whole bakery in my mouth right Do now. Do actually have bread? I don't... I find some. <laughs> I can look. BRB. Pam, you are absolutely right. I could be in advertising. Like, I don't know how long I'd last in that particular job. This is what happens. I don't know. Oh, up on the edge there, Jonas. Behind the uh, the cart in the window. Mm. I was really, really hot. Like, really hot. Whew. That one's hotter than... Uh, right? <laughs> that one was um eat some bread i'm gonna try that oh. i love bread get in there i've never tried bread before does this really help oh. i'm thinking about a fire extinguisher right now <laughs> oh, did you hear that my throat just made a crazy sound oh good lord Oh my gosh, I am crying. That is so hot. No clip now. No, do it too much. Hit the thumbs up if you want another spoonful. <laughs> we have to go. <laughs> my gosh, that was hot. Crypto, I hope I hope I've allowed this stream to meet your expectations. I can't even see straight right now. My eyes are watering from that. That was a good spoonful. That stuff is hot. Uh, is no joke. I see how this works. It's picking up the capsaicin. I'm putting on my lip. My lip is hot. Yeah. I'm pressing it against it. I'm it's rubbing my eyes hot. with a napkin full of hot sauce and wondering why my eyes are watering. <sighs> Americans, not the brightest lot. Good Lord. <laughs> that was really hot. Wow. All right. I almost went for the... The um, Mad Dog 357, which is a 357,000 357, Scoville. We haven't tried that one yet. Crypto, I'll save that one for next time. Oh, can you see nice? Yeah, he has like 5 million. Uh, I'll let you accept. Yeah. We're second. To, thank you. We're second. I appreciate it. I will accept second. Anyway. You know, second to Casey Neistat is like being... Uh, that's like that's like that's like coming in first in any other award ceremony. I'll take that. That kind of runner up status I don't mind. Oh, I'm just glad we were nominated. Oh, Pam, what do you rate us? Oh. I don't really care what any of you say. Just Pam just Pam's like you guys are just idiots. <laughs> She's like I Oh, we have a new guy. <laughs> J3 uh, J J3 J3B. J3B, you just missed it. These knuckleheads dared me to take a spoonful of this. Well, I, I'm saying that. They didn't. I, they didn't dare me to do anything. I just did it because I'm not very well, bright. No, Crypto did. Crypto asked to see some pain. He said he was here and for... And we did it. We showed nice. Crypto pain. Uh, guys, if you have a second, um, click on... If you click to the right in the chat, you guys all know this. You can pull up someone's channel. You guys ever in the UK are staying in the crypto mansion for free. J3B is a guy. He's out of, you're out of Canada. Um, he does, uh, he does this sort of really cool, uh, I don't know what you call it. I want to call it like archaeology. He goes out into these areas and uses um, metal detectors and digs for stuff and pulls up these like treasures out of nowhere. I'm not even quite sure how he does it because I've watched his videos and he's like, we're going into this field. And he just sort of magically stumbles across like really old glassware and cool pieces of old. He had an he had an axe head, J three. That was like uh, it was I the thing was I think the late sixteen hundreds, early seventeen hundreds, like a French, like a, a worker's axe. He pulled the whole thing up. Like it looked beautiful. It was amazing. Right. So, Pam, thank you very much. Crypto, <sighs> you guys ever staying in the UK? <sighs> You're staying in the crypto mansion for free. <laughs> All right. I, I want to be in the crypto mansion. I, do you actually have a crypto mansion? Was it bought with cryptocurrency? That's all I want to know. Oh. 
Metal tank. Oh, so I, there you oh. go. So J, yeah, you have to wait for my delay for the things to come through. So J3, yeah, he found a, uh, the axe head was 1575 to 1620. It's amazing. I swear. Guys, oh, if you want to see something cool, click on his channel. Go over there and check out some of his stuff. It is absolutely amazing. If you like looking for things under floors. I, I swear. I, oh, whew. I have, hey, guys, breaking news. I do care. I, I care. <laughs> I care about not eating another spoonful of that hot sauce. That was brutal. Oh, all right. Listen, I want to thank all you guys for stopping by. I want to thank you for... Meg! What's oh, up, Meg? Meg Larson. Hiya, honey. You missed all the fun. They made us... They, they asked us... They chow... I was dared. Let's get down to it. I was dared. I was... I, I got dared. You know what happens when people dare me. Um, congratulations to uh, Drew, the British cook, for winning the murky jerky. Congratulations to Magdalena for the Canadian steak. Check out Rhea's Roadkill Jerky uh, down in the description. We've got links to all that. Thank you guys for stopping by and participating, and thank you for being part of our channel. We, we can't say this enough. A lot of you guys know that our whole channel was, is, is all about community. The only thing we ever want to do is to make friends, have fun, and do things that make people laugh and smile. Pam, next live is when he goes to the lift. <laughs> <laughs> <It's good. laughs> we could do a whole nother... Yeah, there will be. There will be. I, I, I literally have to like make sure that I have enough toilet paper stocked up. This could be dangerous tomorrow. Oh, and it, it doesn't burn so good. <laughs> Sonny, it doesn't. It hurts. So listen... Everybody, check out each other's channels in the comments. Pam have a, has a great felting channel. Uh, J3B has an amazing, an amazing metal detecting. I'm going to call it an archaeology channel. I don't care what you say. Um, crypto crypto cruising. Hobby. I'm actually a professional DJ in the UK. Wow, sweet. That's awesome. But he also, but crypto has a great channel that's all about cryptocurrency, and if you, which to me is baffling to begin with. So he's the guy to go to if you want to learn anything about the ins and outs of cryptocurrency. Listen, I'm done. I'm going to go. Can uh, we start that hashtag, feel the burn? Yeah, we should. I should feel the burn. <laughs> I'll be feeling the burn tomorrow. I promise you. I promise you. <laughs> so listen guys thank you very much for tuning in we appreciate it uh and we'll be seeing you again very soon pay attention for that sauce i talked about that we got coming out that new hot sauce it's a killer uh and we'll see you again uh probably next weekend you want to go for next weekend yeah we're really loose on this whole live streaming thing. We're not really scheduled, but we'll get no, it in. Oh, Breeze and Co., you're late. It's all right. <laughs> Breeze and Co., you didn't miss anything. It was nothing happened. It was really uneventful. Um, these are all just tears of joy. <sighs> all right, well, you guys have a great rest of your day. Enjoy the rest of your weekend, guys, and we will see you again soon. Peace. Peace out.